This game is rated M for Mature. Hello everyone, and welcome back to God of War. I am Wishblade, and this is Kratos, and... When, as I went over here and I saved my game, just because, well, you gotta save your game now and then. I broke something, somewhere, and I got a little message telling me I have enough to power up, so... Let us hold down the X button and power up the Blades of Chaos! Like so! Blades of Chaos are now level 2 with new moves. L1, the guard button, and X will do Apollo's Ascension. And you can also do it in the air. And R1 will do a Hermes Rush, which can also be done in the air. And new ability, Rage of the Gods. When meter is filled, that one right there, you press the L3 and R3 to activate. And you go into crazy mode. Let the Rage of the Gods drive your blades, Kratos. Um, okay, I will do that eventually, but not right now. That is also a thing with Rage of Chaos. Or Rage of Chaos, Rage of the Gods. Hello there. We are at the gates of Athens. Lovely. It takes a while to fill up again. So really, use it if you really, really must. For whatever reason. Because you won't be using it constantly all the time. But whatever. Hello. Destroy Ares. And the gods will forgive you your past. Okay. I will just go ahead and do that. Sure. How the heck am I going to defeat a freaking god of war? Now, sure, I'm very awesome, and just look at me. Look at Kratos. He's amazing. Oh, hi there, enemies. I suppose I can start with you. Let us try some of our new stuff. Hold the thing to block, and Apollo's Ascension. Okay, so that is a thing. And what if we do it in the air? Maybe if I could do it in the air. That's, I'm not sure that's entirely what it is, but... Oh, sirs, I just want to show off some moves. Yeah, okay. In the air, L1 and X... Is this spinning thing. So that is a thing. And with the R1 button, we have Hermes Rush. Basically a shoulder bash. And boink. And a mighty fine stomp. Alright then. Well, you guys are going to die. Here you go. Boink. Just to have some blooms of Prometheus. And I'm not sure. Yeah, I can't grab these right now. They are too strong for me to grab them. Just like that. So we need to weaken them first. And out. Would you kindly not do that? That wasn't very nice. Let me just have some of you. Okay, or we can just kill you. Fair enough. That's also something. You don't have to grab them, but you can if you want to. Give me more orbs. Now gate thing, or door thing, or whatever the heck this is. Oh, fair enough. No, it won't. Okay. And I'll show you Rage of the Gods later. Not right now. First and foremost, we have things to kill and places to go. We need to figure out what we're doing around here. Because, well, it's a very vague description of our job. Kill Ares, the god of war. Okay, but how? How do we do this? There you go. And then you die. Okay, that was Bloom of Prometheus. Nope. That was Bloom of Prometheus. Well, hello there. There's a hole in the wall. That means there are secrets. Delicious, juicy secrets. Light in here. Is there anything over here? Just making sure. No. There's nothing hiding behind there. But is there something hiding all the way back here? Uh, enemies, for one thing. There you go. You guys are so silly. You fall on your butts all the freaking time and stop attacking. Oh, maybe I should try to do some of that blocking I did so very well against the Hydra. Maybe I should do that. And now I'm just blocking too damn much. Oh, yep. Yeah. Wow, you knocked me all the way back here. That's not very nice of you. Also, I saw a circle. Let me go. That's not very nice of you. I don't want you to grab me. Bad touch. Bad touch. Oh. Come back here. Come back here. Okay. Now I can't grab you anymore. You've recovered. Up. Oh, here you go. Have your friend back. Are you still around? No, I think you're dead now. So it's all good. Thank you. Now that is a chest. And I want the chest, obviously. But what does it contain? It gives me Phoenix Feather. Six of those in total will increase your overall magic meter. So there you go. That is something. Although, really, considering, I think it'd be more appropriate for the Phoenix Feathers to increase your health, considering they are Phoenixes and they are the symbol of rebirth, kinda. Stuff like that. And the Gorgonai. Well, you'll see eventually. Go away, buckets. You are in my way. 
What's over here? It is a lift. Activate it. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. That is a very annoying lever. It seems so difficult to do anything with. Now, hello. Hey, I see enemies. I also see health. Now, eh, I'll get that later if I need it. Run! Run! The beasts have taken Athens! Look out! Well, all right, and then those are Minotaurs. Why were those guys just standing around? I don't get it. Ow. Don't hurt me. Have a plume. Also, there are two of you. I'm not sure how I like the fact that there are two of you right now. Not a major fan. Go away. Don't attack me. Yeah, these guys are slightly slow, so... But still, they are, they are kind of strong. They can be kind of strong. And I suppose I could do the Rage of the Gods. I don't really think I need it, but I could if I wanted to. And then these guys would die very fast. Yeah, that one guy was still attacking. And then this guy attacked me. He found an opportune moment. And he took it and struck me down. Now, you can use the circle button to execute this guy. And that will give you health. Or you can keep killing him. Or killing them, something. And they will give you red orbs for experience. Now, obviously there's a health chest over there. Well, which is worse, so I don't really think I need health right now. I'd rather get the experience. Thank you. I saw you over there. I saw ya. Oh dear. Don't attack me. Wow. That's a nice attacking combo you got there. I got one too. I call it the Plume of Prometheus. I should almost have a counter. How many times do I say, ow, Plume of Prometheus? How many times do I also say, ow? That might also be a thing. Nope, don't you attack me. Yeah, you go ahead and do your little combo, that's fine. Then I do mine. First I do mine, then you do yours, and then we just keep going back and forth. There we go. That should be all the Minotaurs in this area, so let us be healing up. And that's why it's sometimes a good idea not to open health and magic chests. You never know when you're actually going to need them by just doing a bit of backtracking. Hello there, magic chest. I don't really need you, but I doubt I'll want to go all the way back down here. And, eh, magic. I don't feel like needing that right now. Not when I have the Pluma Prometheus. <laughs> I'll just go further up. Elevator music. Oh, hello. As a chest. And obviously, the health and magic chests, not really that necessary. They don't give experience, so, eh. Yo! Have reinforcements arrived? Ares has brought these beasts to Athens! Without help, the city will fall! The gates destroyed! You'll have to fight another one! Well, that didn't go so very well for you guys, and what's with the stomping? Hi! As a Cyclops. Now, how are we gonna deal with that? The usual way. Also, up! Dodge the gigantic ball of spikes. Otherwise, it's gonna hurt. Oh dear. But it's not so bad. You just do a dodge roll at the right time, and everything's good. Oh dear. And this guy, definitely gonna do the execution. Hoppa! Be mindful of these buttons. They can change. They won't always be the same. You, sir, you have fallen by the power of me. Oh, look, your brother is here. I'll take him out as well. There you go, there you go. Well, sir, if you're gonna do anything, you should probably start attacking me. Oh, there. there you go. That's how you attack. Alright. I'm gonna execute you now. Yeah, see? It's not entirely the same buttons. Whoop! And... Yoink! So brutal, so spectacular! And... I saw your friend over here. I'll take him out as well. Whoop! Don't you hit me. And a point. Actually... One, two, three, and four. Now you can hit square a few a few more times, so three times instead of just two, but I don't know. Sometimes you just gotta be fast before the enemy strikes again. But these guys, nothing to worry about. Beautiful. And that opened the door over there. 
But, just because, just because for kind of completion's sake. Hello, chest. I'ma open you up now. Oh, if I could, do it proper. Yoink. There we are. Now we can go back up and, and, um, what was I about to say? Something. Through the gate, you see a bridge that's something to Atlas, but the gate has been damaged beyond repair. It will never function again. Well, that's too bad. There must be another way to get around and onto the bridge. Yes, indeed, there must be, and I will find it. What about this thing? We can't get in there to that chest. We can't open this if we were on the other side, but we're not. And something that is going to happen a few times here and there. Chests that are either obstructed or entirely hidden away. You can only see this if you actively go over here to find it. Now, I hopefully will be getting all the chests that are in the game, but I can't be certain. If I miss one, it's not, it's not so bad. And this one changes between health and magic for whatever you need. I didn't really need either, but whatever. Might as well open it, because why the heck not? Oh, hello. Hello, box. You look breakable. I want to break you. And a boink. There we go. Anything that is breakable, it shall be broken. That is just the way of life. Yoink. Thank you. Oh. There's a way out of this room. How very convenient. Now let's just find a way to actually get up there. Thank you. And you can see there is something over here you can grab. And voila. Again, hidden chests. First and foremost, with Walken Eye and some magic. So let's just get it, because why the heck not? Thank you. So yeah, you gotta keep your eyes open and try to explore a little bit if you want to find everything. Red orbs for me. And then we walk ever so slowly this way. I don't know what you'd call this. Um, I can't remember. I can't remember the word in voice crack. Now get me down, please. Something. Oh, okay, that was not the way you're supposed to do it. That wasn't very good. I guess I'll go up there now, because we need to go this way. I'll figure out how to get off these things without jumping, because jumping can, at times, just get you too far away. That's not very nice now, is it? Now let me down here. Let me down from here. There we go. Okay. I just needed to hold the control stick in the, in the proper direction. And yet again, I could leave, but I don't want to. I'd rather get this, and also here, which is maybe more obvious, this chest right here. You can also see, yep, there's the hidden ones, and you can jump over there. I'm fairly certain you can jump from that location right there, but I don't want to. So. Oh! What is that thing? It's a shiny... Aphrodite. Kratos, the gods are pleased with your progress, but your current skills will not be enough to defeat the minions of Ares. I offer you the power to freeze your enemies where they stand, but you must earn such a gift. Queen of the Gorgons, bring me her head, Kratos, and I will give you the ability to wield its power. Well, great then. We're fighting Medusa. And yet again, oh dear! No, 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 Two ways to deal with that weird little thing, and you can probably guess what it is. It is indeed the petrification. Either dodge roll like a madman, or attack her so much that you interrupt her little gaze thing. And all her other attacks are easily lockable. You just need to actually block it proper. Go away! Is that an attack? I don't know. Stop that, Medusa! You are so very mean. Okay. You are very fast. I'm not sure I like it. Fast opponents are so annoying. And also in these spectacle fighters and everything, 
I always tend to find the female enemies are usually the most annoying. The same can be applied to Medusa right here. Also, if you can get her grounded, then it is a very good idea to just keep attacking her. Keep attacking her. Just keep her. Don't let her get up. Never let her get up. Stay down, woman. That is not something I should probably say, but whatever. Stop it. Medusa, would you kindly just fall down? Oh, nope, nope. There you go. Have a smackdown. And now we need to rotate the stick to do a thing. Alright, there we go. And a something. And get me that. Mighty kind. I just got a Medusa head. And Medusa's gaze. Freeze and destroy them all with Medusa's gaze, and the power of the Gorgon will be yours. Oh, really? Well, I'll just go right ahead and do that. Hold down the L2 button to aim, and then press square. Why is square that color? That looks more like the color of the circle button, but whatever. To fire. Freeze and smash all the Minotaurs to progress. Okay. Now, a good thing to do is line them all up ever so nicely at some point. Uh, okay, that's, again, wrong button. Because then you freeze multiple at the same time. Oh dear, ow. Oh dear, there are more of them. There are more of them. Oh dear, okay. I'm not very good at this, clearly. Magic and I are not so good friends. Oh dear, got three of them at the same time. Beautiful. Oh, hi there. How many are there? Oh dear, there's a lot of you. Oh dear, ow. Damn it, people. Why would you, would you do this to me? There we go, and... Boink! Go with the gods, Kratos. Go forth in the name of Olympus. Why, thank you, my dear. Now, breaking people, or freezing enemies and then breaking them, will give you 15 experience, and if you do it while they're airborne and they fall down and break on their own, that's 30 experience. So now you know. It's just a something. But yeah, again, with the phoenix feathers and gorgon eyes, gorgon, we have Medusa's gaze, so that's kind of magic related, uh, whatever. That's nitpicking. It's alright, I suppose. Oh, hi there, guys. How are you doing? Have a plume. I know you want the plume. Everyone loves a good plume. Oh, dear. Would you kindly not? So, yeah, Medusa's gaze, kind of... Kinda more interesting than Poseidon's Rage, in my opinion, but whatever. No oh, enemies, come over here. Okay, maybe not like that, I just wanted the other guy to come over to you. Oh, there you go. Okay, come over here. I'm over here. I'm not sure what I'm, if I'm even hitting you guys. I think I am. Boink! There we go. Yeah, you can see 15 and 30 and everything. It is glorious. And now I don't really have any magic left. So, can't do it all the time. Oh, hi there, sir. How are you doing? Is there anything hiding over here? No. Sometimes there will be instances of that. Where you climb up a ladder and then you can actually jump to the foreground for hitting things. And hello there. What have we here? That is a cracked wall. And I want to break it. But I suppose first and foremost I need to go over here. Pull this ever so slightly back. And boink. I broke a wall. I feel very good about this. <laughs> oh, automatic reload. How lovely. Now, let's just turn this wee baby around. Because I needed to break other things as well. Like this wee little door over here. Back we go. And fire in the hole. Now, I don't think I can break down that door over there. But I don't need to. Absolutely not. Come here, lever. Thank you. The final shot will be taken as we destroy this cracked wall over here. Like so. Thank you. And those chests over there, we'll get them later. Not right now. We will get them soon enough. Now, let me get... Let me get... past the goddamn, um... Crossbow Ballista Phoenix Feather. That's not what it is, no. It is crossbow or ballista thing. Do I need health? Eh, kind of. So, give it to me. Thank you. Now let us be moving on and see what else we got around here. 
That is a door we can't do anything with. And before we go up this ladder, I just want to go this way. Is there anything over here? No, there shouldn't be. But maybe downstairs. Ah, mate. I just want to jump down, guys. Thank you. Mighty kind. I think I heard enemies. Yes, I did. Oh, dear. There you go. Have a point. Have a Hermes rush because I want to. Just to spice things up a bit. Oh, dear. Boink. That is also one way to avoid enemies, potentially. Get into the air, where they may not hit you, necessarily. Ow! I have left my skills somewhere. In some place. I left them at the office. Oh, hi there. Nope, nope. They're mad. I just want to grab you. I just want to grab you guys. Yoink. Go for a spin, yet again. Oh, hello. Hello, come here. You go this way. Is your buddy still over there? I'm not even sure if he is. I guess not. Oh well, here is a chest. Thank you. With another Gorgon eye. And just because, let's just open this. You never know when it might be necessary. And that necessary just might be very soon, actually, come to think of it. Now, we had another ladder up here that we need to climb. But, considering how much time we've dealt or spent here in at the gates of Athens. I think we're gonna call this a weird little episode, and then we'll go up higher and see what else we can find around here in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching, and until next time, see ya later.